what is up guys it's Amari boss and I am back with another gaming video and today I'm gonna give you some commentary from me playing a game called Paladin's Champions of the Realm a lot of again. people compare it to overwatch but we'll get into that on another day let's just jump right in I'm playing the tank Inara and she is you know mother earth herself all right and I get to choose a legendary loadout and I'm gonna choose mother's grace which allows me to get 20% increased damage reduction and CC immunity um, when I cast Prepare my ability for called battle. Earth and Guard. Earth and Guard is my right click and it allows me to take reduced damage alone by itself but with the addition of the legendary I now take even more reduced damage and on top of that I am immune to CCs um, so that means no stuns, Five, silences, four. none of that. Three, As you two, can see, I almost one. left my base and started and the so game without buying my first item, but unfortunately I got my, but fortunately I got my, sorry about that guys. Um, I decided to buy Haven, which is going to give me even more damage reduction, which is important as a tank, considering you're going to be uh, taking most of the damage for your team. And right out of the gate, I decided to uh, go get hooked by a Makoa, I guess, I guess that was the best first of action blood. for me what happened um and you're gonna see the victor try to flank me from behind and again i get hooked by makoa but i'm able to take him out you can see all the damage coming from victor he's not hitting a lot of his shots which is hurting him a lot um and this vivian is doing a lot of work as well as this king this king is keeping my health on no, top of it, she is making sure that I absolutely do not go the down. Um, there's a Mave over there, and she's she's gonna try to get a flank, but I'm gonna see her, and of course it's gonna go back to one v one versus me and Makoa. That Makoa tries to throw out a hook, which I slyly decide to dodge, and as we move the payload, I decide to put up another wall um, so that we can get some eliminations on the other team. Of course, the payload's gonna roll right through that wall. Um, you can see the series right there trying to stop us, trying to get some damage in. That's not happening. And of course, my team is just killing it right now. That Jin, that Ying, that Vivian, me all together we're just doing too much damage the other team can't handle us and we're um and we're just destroying them i pop another wall which is gonna lead to this makoa getting ko'd i believe oh no he manages to get away unfortunately i can not capitalize on that um but it doesn't matter anyway because they're just gonna bunch up in the corner which is gonna allow my team to take them out even easier um this victor i'm not entirely sure what he's doing he's getting a little close and he's not really doing the damage output that would uh, that would make it you know since before to get as close as he was um and this makoa just keeps coming back for more this makoa thinks that he can take me and that's just i i i disagree that it's not happening so my first priority is going to be getting rid of this healer which is serious um and I, unfortunately, as I'm trying to take care of Sirius and Makoa, I get hit by a Victor ultimate. And I'm going to go down here for the first time since the round started. But that is okay. It's going to allow me to buy an item. And I decide to buy Wrecker just to push through Makoa's shield a lot easier. Seconds remaining. Um, I'm almost there. And now we are going to rush back to the payload as quickly as possible um, my team is still holding their own the payload's not getting pushed back and I'm just gonna come up remaining. behind this Makoa and I'm going to help to end his life Ten, um, and I'm just nine, gonna get back eight, on the payload and seven, we're just going to move six, this thing five, all the way to four, the end three, with literally three seconds left on the clock it is going to be one successful push um, we had a lot of good, good teamwork day. despite nice not having comms up, which is um, something that you don't really see quite often, especially in ranked play. Um, but now we are just going to wait for this next round to start. And with Kronos, I have all my cooldowns reduced. Um, and as you can currently see, Point I have my ultimate. In 15 um, seconds. And let's just see how this goes. Um, as if you guys noticed, I was using my Earth and Guard a lot, which is my right click. The Five, um, ability 
where Three, I kind of two, surround myself one. in in, in rock shrapnel and and I just push through everything Attack. that the enemy team is giving us and uh, it's it's really been a lifesaver. I've been able to stay on point, and I've been able to uh, I've been able to win a lot of fights. And right out the gate, I'm gonna put up the wall. I'm gonna block them from getting on to the point. Mako um, was going to pop his ultimate, um, and I'm going to pop my ultimate right back, and that's gonna allow us to destroy him, even with his what is it, 9,000 health. Um, and I'm just going in there's the game ultimate which is going to give us continue and all of her teammates continue with healing. Um, that Jin is gonna take care of the victor and we are just gonna go ahead and cap the point. Um two Makoa's gonna come back for more. Um, he's gonna hop on the point, pop his shield. Zeris is going to I think that's her own. I'm not entirely sure. I have never played Zeris a day in my life. Um, she's just not my type of character. I'm gonna pop that wall in front of Zeris to prevent her from doing damage. Um, Victor's gonna pop his ultimate. He's not gonna take anybody down with it, unfortunately. Um, and I'm gonna get a, the last hit on that Zeris to take her down. Um, now I'm just on the point waiting for them to approach because I know that with my healer and my main damage healer, I know there's nothing they can do. I'm gonna pop that wall. I'm gonna pop that wall right there just in case um, the just in case the Vivian, uh, the sky. I apologize. The sky on the other team wanted to come around that way. She was only gonna have one entrance, which was both protected by me looking out and my teammates looking out. Um, Makoa is hiding somewhere around here, trying to recover his health. Um, and he gets taken out. I have to pop my earthen guard to survive that ultimate from Sky. And Sky is gonna take try to take me on 1v1. That does not work out well for her. As you can see, she immediately went down. My ultimate is at 96% in climbing. And unfortunately, I don't get to use it on anybody because I won't need it. Um, we're just gonna go ahead and push through to the cap. Um, this Makoa is going to try to hook me and stop me in my track, but that's not working out for him. And as you can see in the last moment there, I tried to use my ultimate just to clear the point, um, but it was unnecessary. We end up getting the cap and the victory. Um, nice job. All in all, it was a pretty easy game, pretty fun game, pretty chilled, laid back game. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Get ready for more gameplay. Thank you for watching, and um, I'll see you guys.